and I'm gonna give you some pointers on how to bag a chick and get with a girl, you know? One, first thing, you have to look good, you have to smell good, you know, you, that's, that's the first thing, the first impression is the best thing, you know? Two, you no, know, seeking out your prey, your victim, or, you know, uh, a, a woman that you may find attractive. Two, always give them, three, always give them eye contact, or if you're not gonna give them eye contact and you're just going for one thing and we all know what we want, that one thing, sex. You look at their mouth. When you look at their mouth, you don't stare at a female in their eyes, you look at their mouth, you giving them reasons to think, multiple things, who knows. And it's also good in your favor. Two, three, four, I mean. All right, how to target females? Um, mainly go for what you like. Your discretion is up to you. Try to get a lot of eye contact as possible because eye contact is letting them know that, you know, hey, I'm here. What's going on? Can we do something later or can we hook up? Or just tell them that, you know? Be honest, be outspoken, be yourself. Don't be a, a prick. Don't be a cocky bastard because you have it. Or, you know, if you don't have it, take your time. You know, there's plenty of women that don't have it. You know, just chuck your motherfucking chin up and give it your all. That's just number one rule right there. And make sure you wash your ass because first impression is the best impression. And that's my tips. Now, what to say? You don't want to come off as an asshole. Yo, shorty, what's good? Let me get your number. Well, I'm from New York. That's how we do it. We pull bitches, you know? But you don't want to do that. You you can either be smooth about it, write your number down, slide it to them. You could uh, do the eye contact thing again, letting them know that you're attracted to them. You can also say little things, comments, you know? Uh, tell her how well she looks or you know, like your hair or just any little thing that you can find that can get her attention. And from there, you just keep going, keep going. All right, now how to get them to go home with you? Offer them out, take them out for coffee, tea, lunch, dinner, movie. From there, you got it, panties is off. Uh, There's nothing else you can do, but take a woman out. Spend some of that little money that you have in your pocket. Take them out. And you will get skins. Granted. Guaranteed. And I'm telling you this. M dot. You heard? Yeah. So, you don't want to be in the streets trying to get a woman. And, you know, because I had bad experiences. Where you meet ratchet bitches. So, you have to choose wisely. Just don't walk up on any woman and try to holler because she has a body or, you know, she's your kind of drink of water. That's not what you're looking for. Unless you're only looking for one thing. And this is not what my, my video is about. It's not about that. It's about getting with them, you know? That's your main goal, your objective. I had a bad little case with this female. I had a bad situation with female you know online this is why you should either go out seek venture because you don't have to go, like you know women lie a lot putting pictures up of their self and it's not really them it'd be, it'd be a fat Russian lady or something you get to her house as a fat Russian lady that's no cool um yeah but I had a bad bad experience online and this is why I don't do online dating and I don't trust any online dating and if you do online dating you're a fucking bozo <laughs> and I'm saying this and that is saying this to you you're a bozo if you're doing online dating you're a bozo go out there take a woman out spend some money don't be cheap do what you have to do as a man I had a bad experience I went out with a woman online come to find out she was a fat Russian chick I'm talking about hair underneath her breast. She has more hair on her fucking chest than I have on my head. And that shit wasn't wavy, you know? So choose wisely, go out, look. Online is blind, you're blind. 
You don't want to do that. You putting all your G in. Oh my, I like your pictures. You look good. This, that, and the third. It's not going to work. You have to go out and look. Go out. Don't sit at home beating your chicken, looking at profile pictures of these false advertisements from females. It's not good. Yeah, like I said, you don't want a bad experience like I had, so choose wisely. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you jerk offs who don't know how to bag women, how to bag women live on cam. And I hope you guys like it. If I get cursed out, I get cursed out. If I get slapped, I get slapped. It's all about trying. Try. Don't do the blind dating thing. Try. So I'm going to show you guys on how to pick up a girl, just like I told you earlier. So now I'm about to go head out and show you how can you pick up a woman, any random chick. You know what I'm saying? Learn and watch. I'm about to see what girl, you know, I can bag to show you guys. It's a little demonstration. How are you doing? Uh, I'm all right. Uh, I'm, just, I'm doing a little documentary, you know, I just saw you instead, you know. Just trying to put some out there for these guys that don't know. Talk to a female, right? But anyways, um, what you doing out here? It's cold. It's cold. I was waiting for my ride. Oh, yeah? Yeah. yeah it's kind of cold out here, so, you know, like, I live around the corner, so you want to just go there, you know? So, oh, thank you. Yeah, I like your hair. Thank you. I like that little two-turn off-earth color you got going. Yeah. It's nice. Thanks. <laughs> so, were you dating? You got any bad friend or something like that? No, not really. Just cool. Yeah, why are you sitting so far away? You should be like, I'm a little closer to me. Like, I'm going to bite you. You want me to bite? Yeah. Unless you want me to bite you, I'll bite you. Oh, you must be into stuff like that. I'm always into stuff like that, you know. <laughs> I like your fish tank. Thank you. It's, I really like it too. Yeah. It's nice. Yeah. yeah, so like what do you like to do for fun? Like Um, I mean, when I'm not at school I'm smoke or drink, you know, I party. Yeah, that's number one shit, man. That's my thing too. But yeah, I think we can we can do that today. Chill out. Yeah. What time you gotta breathe? What time you gotta leave? I don't know, maybe my ride gets here. Okay. Um, so I have a couple ideas we can do for the day. What you got in mind? We can go upstairs and get on a good foot. <laughs> we definitely can do that if you want to. But it's just options. <laughs> yeah, so we can do that if you want. <laughs> Cause I'm a nasty. <laughs> oh yeah, and I have some some nice lingerie for you to put on upstairs. I think you would look really good in it. Really? Yeah. We got the little slim physique. Nice little body on you. I like it. It's nice. That's why I'm so anxious to. Hurry up and get you upstairs and pull those poetic justice out your head. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> like your room? Yeah, this is the little humble boat. Yo, you you gotta breeze. This is some uncut shit. So get up out of here. <laughs> See? That was somewhat easy, but yet, it's still complicated. All you do need to do is make them laugh, give them a lot of eye contact, you know, uh, be gentle, you know, simple shit that you're supposed to know as a man. Um, compliments is great. Uh, staring at her mouth, making her wonder, you know. Uh, like what I did today, that was renegade style, you know, straight to the point. <laughs> you can do it like that if you want. Or just be a man, be gentle, and try to put that work.